good morning or whatever time it is where you're watching this. I am in Australia trying to shoot a beach scene. Uh, hopefully the traffic noise and the wind noise and the surf noise isn't too much. Also, I have no idea how to use my camera and we're gonna do some color grading to try to make this look a little bit better. But we're just gonna have a little fun here and just talk about something that is actually kind of serious. We're gonna jump right into why we suck at marketing. I've worked with a lot of agencies that are just fantastic at delivering results for their clients, but for some reason, they can't deliver results for themselves. So we're gonna go into the four main problems and how to fix them in just a second. One of the things I want to say is that we don't suck at marketing because we don't understand the technical elements of doing marketing and advertising. We do them as part of our business. We know how to do it for our clients. That's not why we suck. We suck for four reasons. The first reason why we suck is what I call the cobbler's kids. You know that old saying of the cobbler's kids have no shoes? This is most of businesses, not just agencies, but pretty much every business out there. They're so busy doing their business, their job, whatever it is that they sell and do for their clients and their customers, that they don't do it for themselves. This is a major problem. And it's really about priorities. It's not that you don't have time, it's that you don't prioritize your marketing over other things that go on in your business. And if you start prioritizing, start putting your kids first and start putting shoes on your kids, then you're going to have a business that grows faster and faster. And I want to share a little example. This guy Brad Leavitt of AFT, a finer touch construction. Uh, I know, not an agency, but this guy's got six kids, wife, building a family, uh, they're growing, they're busy in all kinds of school activities, and yet he puts out content on social media uh, every single day, multiple times per day, that's helping him grow his construction company. And I just noticed this morning that he's launched a podcast. So not only is he doing all this stuff on Instagram and Facebook and other places, but he's now added additional content to market his business by doing a podcast. So if a guy like that, with a bunch of kids, family responsibilities, and a successful construction company with crews working on new homes and remodels in the Phoenix metro area, if this guy can be able to produce content every single day for his construction company, you should be able to do it for your agency also. The second reason we suck at marketing is we don't have our eye on the bullseye. The bullseye, your target market. Who are they? Are you speaking directly to them? Are you putting all your ads and all your marketing in front of them? Most of the people that I've talked to don't really understand who their target market is. They don't know who their ideal client is. Even those who have said they've niched have not figured out how to target the people that would be the best customers for them. What we do is we put out content that we think is going to appeal to everyone in our market, maybe even just everyone in general. And every time we do content like that, it just doesn't resonate. People watching it just don't know that it's for them. So what we need to do is start making marketing that speaks directly to the people we want as customers. Maybe even just blatantly saying, this is for you. Your message is not clear. Nobody knows what you do. Someone asks you, hey, what do you do? And you ramble on for 10 minutes trying to explain the things that you do for whoever you do it for, and they're lost. They're lost within seconds. And this happens all the time. You create, well, wait till that fire truck goes by. And this happens all the time. We create marketing that we think matters, we think speaks to our target market, and yet we don't really get right into the point. We don't get into the problem that it solves. We don't get right into who it's for. We don't get right into the results that it's going to get the person consuming that marketing material. We just 
go on and on, kind of like my videos. We just go on and on. This is something that we've got to get better at. We've got to have crystal clear messages that we share. I've got a video on how to create your positioning statement so people know exactly what you do. You can find it in the description below or in the link above. When you start creating crystal clear messages for your ideal customer, they're going to say, hey, that's for me. And they're going to raise their hand and want to talk to you. That's the power of being clear. This is the stuff we put out. We don't put any effort into our creative. Uh, and creative is defined as what ad agencies call your image, your videos, your copy. These are the elements that make up an ad or your marketing materials. All the images, the words, the way it's uh, designed, all those things matter and they make a massive impact. A well-designed marketing campaign, a well-designed ad will look amazing. It will attract people. They will see it as a higher quality. And it's really today one of the few differentiators in the market. All your competitors sound the same, they look the same, they're doing the same messaging to the same customer base. And the only way you're really going to stand out is to be able to do exceptional creative. And the funny thing is, is exceptional is relative because you only have to be a little bit better than your competitors and they're not trying. You're probably not trying all that hard either. So what you need to do is start getting a good graphic designer. You need to get a good uh, videographer or do like I do and try to make your way through videography and be able to produce great videos, great ads, great copy. And this is the thing that's gonna differentiate you from everyone else. All right, hopefully you'll take these four lessons and start applying them to your marketing and advertising. I want you to prioritize it. I want you to target your ideal customer. I want you to be clear in your message and make it look amazing. And so be amazing and hit that like button, subscribe, share, comment below, and then do all the socials. And I'll see you right back here in the next video.